Adam, you guys scored seven goals last night and then come in today's game, score two, and then obviously the empty netter. Uh, just overall, what did you feel about the way you guys played today? Uh, you know, they, they played a good game over there. Uh, they obviously didn't give us a lot, and, um, you know, we feel like we didn't give them a lot either. So it's kind of a, a defensive game. Um, I think tomorrow we obviously want to, uh, you know, create a little bit more offensively, but continue to, you know, not give them much. So, um, yeah, we're just going to have to look at the video, obviously, and, um, you know, try to create more offensively. When they got that goal to start at the third period, was there ever a sense of urgency, or did you guys feel confident and just sticking to the way you guys have been playing? Uh, yeah, no, I think we're a very confident team in there. Um, you know, we have, you know, great goalies that we know are going to hold it down. And, um, you know, right, right um, from the back end up, you know, I think we're confident with our lineup. So um, when things like that happen, um, you know, there's no panic in our game, I don't think. And we just keep going. Played on the line today with Dimitri Timoshov and Jerry Brock. How do you think that felt playing with two offensively skilled players like that? Yeah, I like playing with those guys. Um, you know, we've played together the last couple games, and, um, you know, when we get out there, we feel pretty comfortable together. And, um, you know, we, we obviously want to create, but, um, you know, we obviously, like you said, being offensive guys, those guys, we got to worry about, um, you know, the D zone first, obviously, and not get ahead of ourselves trying to, you know, create offense. As time goes on, do you feel more comfortable as an AHL centerman in your own zone, in the offensive zone? Yeah, yeah. I think obviously when you when you first come in, there's, um, you know, a little bit of an adjustment that you got to make. Um, you know, coming from junior, there was times where you'd blow the zone and um, try to create offense because you were allowed to. But you know, now if you if you try to do that, uh, they're going to capitalize on opportunity. So you just got to be a little bit smarter, I think, and uh, more defensive minded when you're playing up here. So you will be the biggest uh, difference between the OHL game and the AHL game. For me, sorry. What's the what's the biggest adjustment you've had to make, uh, just in terms of the style of play? Um, yeah, you know that. Um, I think everyone can capitalize. I think coming from the dub, um, you know, teams have a big difference. I think from the top guys to uh, the bottom guys in here, everyone, um, you know, is able to make plays and able to capitalize. So uh, it doesn't matter who you're out there against. You got to make sure that you're playing well in your own zone. And um, you know, like I said before, being defensive minded instead of just offensive minded. You haven't scored as well, obviously, yet as you did in your junior career. Was that frustrating at first, or have you started to, you know, kind of trust the process with that? Yeah, no, definitely um, trust the process. I think, you know, in junior, if, um, you know, I started slow there too, and, um, you know, the first couple of years were a struggle for me, and, um, you know, slowly got better. So um, they do a great job here developing us, um, whether it be off the ice and on the ice. So, um, you know, like you said, just kind of trust the process and, um, you know, believe in yourself and believe that, um, you know, you'll be able to do something down the road.